Hi, welcome to Laura's View and Tara too. In this video, we're going to talk about med beds. This may be a term that's familiar to you. It may not be. I'm going to come at it from a layman's perspective because that's exactly what I am. Med beds are a new type and way of <clears throat> achieving wellness for humans that has not been made available to the public, but is way past the discovery stage. Med beds apparently use, they work at the subatomic or changing back to your original DNA when there's issues and can work at, and they can regenerate limbs. They have amazing abilities from what I'm reading in, in alt media sources. Um, and I have had a lot of people asking me to do a read about med beds. It was difficult to decide how to frame the question um, because that's so important. It's not a question of do they exist? They do. Are they being made and utilized? To some extent, yes. Everybody's kind of wondering when they're gonna go mainst mainstream and the universe doesn't always recognize time like humans do. So first of all, back to what a med bed is. Let me show you a, a picture that is frequently used to demonstrate what they're going to look like. Okay. And wow, if they can regenerate limbs and correct issues from disease and put, make medicine actually be able to focus on wellness and wholeness rather than illness and pill popping, that would be fabulous. Now I'm gonna show you one other um, picture. It's a YouTube video. If I hope some of my viewers are, are fluent in this language, I'm not. And they didn't have English subtitles, but it seems to be about actual med beds being unpacked and delivered. Let's, I'll show you where it is. And maybe somebody can uh, enlighten us in the comments and see if I'm right. I don't wanna be wrong, but that's what this appears to be. Hang on. Okay, so here seems to be a uh, more genuine representation of what a med bed is going to look like. Exciting, isn't it? So <clears throat> before I do the tarot read, something else I was told, and it makes logical sense, so let's discuss it a little bit, is that to actually learn how to use the MedBec technology to its fullness, it's going to require people about 18 months to get familiar with the entire process and how to use these units effectively. So while we know that MedBeds are being produced now, that at some point they will go mainstream, that our health systems will have a complete change over to this type of wellness and health care. We need to have those machines be available in enough numbers that people can start going through the 18 month treatment. So what I would suggest to you is among your friends and neighbors and colleagues, if anybody seems to drop off the radar <laughs> quietly and come back with some ailment, that doesn't seem to be bothering them anymore, but they refuse to talk about it. They may have benefited from being in the early stages, the training stages of MedBec use and had to agree to sign an NDA to that effect. I know in my own community, a veteran was contacted by <clears throat> veteran services and told, that he should come back in. There were some new treatments that might be available for his health issues. Haven't heard any more about it. And if that is a signal that he was going to be offered one of the chances at medbed healing, of course, he's not going to be able to talk about it. But if we have, we people with eyes on the ground are watching our friends, neighbors, colleagues, children of friends, neighbors, colleagues, and seeing if we see indications like that, I think that will tell us that we're getting a little closer to a rollout. Because again, 
um, our health professionals are going to need the training and that's going to take a while. And to get the training, they're going to need access to the units to train on. It makes logical sense. So our question for the universe tonight is going to be not do they exist, but simply, and since I've heard that it takes 18 months for training, let's put an 18 month limit on this. In 18 months, what will the universe be able to tell us about what MedBev technology will look like to the average human being in 18 months? Will it be evident? Will it be rolling out? Is there cause for celebration and news looking ahead to 18 months? So instead of past, present, future, I'm going to say present, near future, 18 months in a Kachina spread. If the universe knows how the layout's going to be, it can provide better answers. Okay, one moment, I'll let you watch me finish the shuffling and we'll see what the universe wants to tell us. And this is what our lab has to share with us tonight. The tower is being indicated by our question, which means we, the viewers, are recognizing we're at a pivotal moment. A, uh, it's called a tower moment, which means um, the end of one era, the start of another, and MedBeds is all about a complete change in our healthcare systems and focusing more on wellness and wholeness rather than treating illnesses and uh, making customers out of patients instead of well people out of patients. Now the situation is a temperance card. This is a, a one of teamwork and moderation. So we're being told not to get overly excited. It is happening. Um, the MedBeds are in production. There are healthcare people that are learning how to use them. Um, but it's not going to happen as fast as we'd like as with so many of these things. But remember, we're on a human timeline and the universe is on an eternal one and working to have our planet and our human race be one that is a boon to the universe rather than a constant issue and aggravation or danger. Okay, so I said that this would be the present. So in the present, we have one thing that's not evident here. With this is a card of uh, that, that talks about recuperation, relaxation, recovery, and with one sword hidden, that usually indicates that there is just information that's not out there. As with so many of these situations that we're inquiring about in current events issues, the magician is being shown here for the near future. Okay. The Magician is a major arcana. In fact, all three of these cards are, which three out of seven says it's a pretty important question. <clears throat> now, he manifests, he can make things manifest. And he often, um, I believe, is telling us to help make things manifest, which means imagine them being these med beds and this technology rolling out sooner than anybody ever dared hope. Imagine it happening in a time frame that helps those who are suffering or ill that we wish they'd come out yesterday for. We can help with that. Not only that, but he, <clears throat> excuse me, he's a card of balance and infinite access to all the elements. So while sometimes he can be about trickery, and I'm worried about that a little bit because he's aspected right near the tower. He is more than that about manifesting and we can help make that be what it's about, especially with temperance balancing things out on the other side. Now in the 18 months future, which was the limit of my question, 
we have the Nine of Cups, which means 90% of the way we are going to be there and we're going to be celebrating and happy. Now, we have the Three of Swords here as a clarifier. Again, we were reminded to have to moderate our expectations. Unfortunately, as we know, there are some people that 18 months is too long. They will have transitioned out of this life. So we're going to be grieving for them that the technology was hidden and it took so long to have it be available to humanity. And that's the heartache we'll have. But in the future, for future generations, and this is a generation card, we have one of abundance and wealth of health care and good things are happening. So I'm sorry if you're if if you need these to happen for you or a loved one tomorrow, you may be having some heartache about that. They are rolling out and the white hats are trying to make a correction of all these hidden technologies and and information as fast as they can. Remember, they are being opposed by evil that, that views us as useless eaters and not worth worrying about. So let's help the magician make this technology happen sooner than anybody dares hope. Imagine a world where they roll out. Imagine a world where healthcare issues are treated sooner, not later, and that this comes out. It's going to happen. It is, it's going to happen in most of our lifetimes. And I'm a senior citizen and I'm expecting to see it and maybe even benefit from it, we'll see. Anyway, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please like, share. You're welcome to comment and subscribe. Thank you so much. Let's think positively. Let's help make that happen, okay? That's called manifesting. And part of our job here is to get better at that because that is probably one of the big things evil fears is that we get better at that. And there'll be a level, skill levels will differ, but we can all do it to some extent. So let's get on it. Good night.